My name is Madhu Krishna. My team is MC Super Solvers from DAV Senior Secondary School Boys 6D. And my team and me are Sol Ninjas. I have created this project or prototype to solve the major problem in the world air pollution. According to WHO data, WHO data, approximately 7 million people die every year because of air pollution and 9 out of 10 people are affected by air pollution in low and middle income countries including India. I have created this prototype to monitor and purify the air. So I will show you how it works. So first we can see the temperature, humidity, harmful gases, concentration and dust in micrograms per meter cube. Mm. The data in the phone through Wi-Fi or internet. So we can view the temperature, humidity, gases, concentration, dust in micrograms per meter cube and the pollution state according to the dust. So now it's very poor because uh, I already tested it so now it's poor but I will show you when it's ready and the components used are an LCD display to view the data which is an addition because of someone uh, some people do not have Wi-Fi or internet so they can view it through this and, uh, and dust sensor to sense the dust an MQ135 gas sensor which can sense various gases like carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, benzene and uh, methane and so and so on. And we have a DHT11 temperature and humidity sensor which senses the temperature and humidity and we also have the main board which is the uh, node MCU and also an L293D to drive this brushless 12 volt brushless DC motor and fan and this is the purification system this works by pulling the dust particulates from the air and pushing it into this plastic container old plastic container and that will settle on this water and we can change the water once to once in a week or two in two to three weeks we can change it according to the usage and then I have done this with the help of my team member Chandra Molishwaran. Okay, now I will show you a demo how it works. So when the dust in micrograms per meter cube reaches uh, uh, above 100 the fan will start spinning and when it reaches below 50 the fan will stop spinning so now i will show you an example so i have an incense stick which produces dust through the smoke so when i go near the sensor the fan starts spinning you can see so it's more than 100 so the fan starts spinning and now when I take it away the fan stops spinning and now when I take it closer to it it detects the dust and it again starts spinning this is how it works thank you for watching my prototype and spending your valuable time this prototype or project can be used for uh, cleaning our homes air and making it pure so we can breathe in and this prototype 
can be made in large scale. For now, I, I have used only this small fan. We can also use the ventilation fan in each and every room and a separate module for each room and a separate uh, humidity sensor, temperature sensor. So each room can have different sensors so we can view different datas and we can also view the dust. Different datas uh, and the sensor datas in each and every room. So this is cost effective and can be bought or made by anyone so i have made this because uh, made this because for a uh, to make it cost effective so i have used very low budget components like the node mcu which, which has a uh, very cost effective and i bought it from offline so it's very cost effective and this can be made to a real project or working model or like a real product to make it like really usable in every home and i have named this project as the air quality monitor and purifier mm. this whole setup needs power supply through an usb cable which we can connect to a power bank or an power outlet from the plugs and if you want to use it through the app like viewing the data through the app anywhere from the world we need to connect this to the internet or wi-fi or something like that and we can also view the data all over from the world wherever and whenever we want so that's all for this project thank you